Okay, quick video show you how to bench test the ECT3000 transmitter and receiver to make sure they're functioning correctly. Um, first, take your receiver, connect it to your battery. Whoops. Now, when you first turn it on, and if this green signal lead is not connected to anything, the ECT should show open condition. That's normal. Uh, we'll turn the receiver on and you can see the center dot is flashing so that means it is picking up the open signal you lock the signal in with the black button um, now the antenna for the open wire is this probe tip so you should be able to go down the green wire and as soon as it passes the end of the connector here that light will go out So that means it's working correctly for the open signal. Now let's test the short signal. In this case, I'm going to take a wire connected to this signal wire and ground it on the battery negative. And we'll turn that tone off, but the transmitter has switched to short, which it should if you grounded the output like that. Check the receiver again. We'll turn it on. You'll see this time it's flashing the arrows. Those are the indicators for the short signal. And again, you'll want to lock in the signal. I'm going to bring it up a little bit. Locks in correctly and shows direction correctly. Then everything's working fine. That's it.